So now it's time for round two with the new virus update. I will point out something I did since last time. I found I had some dust daisies in one of my containers. Uh, yep, there are. I've already put them in to the virus scanner and got the photophobia virus out of that. Photophobia virus. And I've got a new thing that says to cure photophobia virus, pick up insect lure and pick up condenser membrane. But, you know, fact is, I got a new virus scan from something that's in the underdust. And I said last time, I was still missing one of the other ones for the immunity booster. So I have a feeling we might find some other stuff in the underdust today. And that's where I'm heading now. New resources to scan. There's new objects to scan in the underdust. So that is a promising uh, sign right there. And of course, you know, nothing in those yet. Let's, let's go. Let's see if this still, it still just bottoms out the FPS in this corner for some strange reason. I, and I, I don't get why, well, one, I guess it's kind of hard to isolate why maybe this is happening in just this corner, but yeah, one corner of the underdust and it just kills the FPS completely. And then as soon as I'm out of the corner, perfectly fine again. Doesn't make any sense. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, man, I see there like, like, saw something just suddenly fly at my face. I was like, what the heck? That is not the same look as the ones uh, up top. That's completely different. Okay, so two different styles of thorn bee hives. Another hive. Wow, look at that right there. I mean, that's just like... They're landing. Those look so big. It still surprises me they do not attack you when you shoot their hive down. They're just kind of like, whatever, dude. So I'm still going to need a hypothermia booster. Uh, as well as whatever else I can find here. Get everything I can. Because I still need the medical reagent. It's, nothing's unlocked that yet. So I don't know if there's just something else I'm supposed to pick up while I'm here. Like, am I supposed to smack that or something else? Oh, let's see. I think this was where we got the virus analyzer thing. Um, yeah, it's just a, it's easier to get oxygen here. Uh, go along. A lot of twisting and turning. Climbing up again. Yeah, this is, I believe, where you get the virus analyzer. Yep. So you got to get that there. And medical reagent. Okay. So a new item up here next to the virus scanner thing. Only got two of them though. So now the hypothermia booster requires photophobia, which again, I scanned the dust daisy with the virus analyzer got the photophobia so you still need to come down here for that and i got the medical reagent but i'm not seeing anything to craft the medical reagent uh so i've got two of them one's going hypothermia booster so i can get down in the lower section and this other one is going to be saved for the immunity booster i need let's get the hypothermia so i can go over here let's find what all there's over here uh, yeah, more crystals. Again, the scan for the large container. Yeah, plenty of dust daisies. Uh, if there is a recipe now to craft the medical reagent, then great. Otherwise, I have no reason to grab that many dust daisies. Really, you only need to grab as many as you're going to use for hypothermia booster. Uh, I'm assuming we're going to get some more uses out of them later, though. Now, noticing now there's a lot more green colander uh, in this area, so... Before, I was always just finding them on the garden towers, the greenhouse towers, but now I'm seeing them all over the place down here. So I'm assuming that's a new addition to the uh, tunnel system. Okay, there we go. All right. But, oh, hey, well, never one. Yeah, grab some more stuff right there, of course. Okay, so this is the one I could see from like up in somewhere up above. Oh, up there. There's a window. I'm going to shoot that. Bye bye. And another one in here where, yeah, last time it's the like the broken airship thing and I have no more room. 
We, we need a bigger backpack for this. Uh, and some more items that stack together. Oh, okay. So, uh, kind of like one of the places you used to not go, and now I can go up here, and it looks like all it is is grabbing some more energy crystal. Oh, uh, and come on, you know, things right there. It's just this little spot you used to be able to, like, kind of get up there not too much, and now it's like it lets you all the way up, but only get energy crystals. I just keep going round and round, and I cannot find anything else that shows, like, a scan option for it. So, I think I've I pretty much have covered everything here. So now it's time to leave. And uh, after I get all my stuff put away, head out to the infected greenhouse tower. That is assuming I can unlock the last virus sample I need. Medical reagent. All right. Research it so I can unlock the recipe. Yes. Medical reagent. Preternatural seeds. So you got to find it in the underdust. To unlock it, and then you gotta still get the immunity booster, which uh, there's still something I missed. The gastroenteritis, I think I, I I need one of those. I can't remember anymore. Dust lettuce, uh, gastroenteritis. All right, so just use your insect lure, and there we go. Extracting antibodies. Gastroenteritis. Yes. Oh, I. I you know, I should have thought of trying that last time. And of course now, I need a medical reagent, which I've already used up all of those, and I need to go get the, uh, was it, preternatural gnarls in order to make my own. So I guess I'm going to the underdust again. So I've got the immunity booster, and now it says, instead of, uh, you know, investigate the preternatural gnarls, it says, reach the exclamation mark on the radar which conveniently is every single one of the infected towers. And I managed to find, well, it's an infected tower, but it's the only one I've seen so far that's positioned inside a mountain range. Like, like nothing else have I come across that is in the middle of a set of mountains. And we've got this one in the middle of a set of mountains. So I'm just like, you know what? This is a unique one. I definitely got to use this one. But where of this abomination? Searching a cure that might be of use to us. All right, searching a cure that might be of use. Well, that's always good. You want it to possibly be of use. We're gonna go ahead and immunity booster. All right, uh, just in case I need to scan. Uh, and that last under dust place I went to did not. Oh wait, I got hurt somehow. I'm not getting the radio. Oh well. Monitor immunity level. Well, I've, that's why I've got the immunity booster. To, to protect me. Right? Uh, oh, yep. Yeah, good thing I brought that, I guess, uh, in case I need to get... Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, oh, ow. Well, this just looks interesting. And maze-like. Can, can I step over this without... Oh, nope. It hurt me. Can't even, like, you know, just raise my foot up a little higher to step over it. I have to, like, step on it. And I just noticed how bad I'm taking health damage uh, by stepping onto the root because I can't step over it. I'm going to go get some first aid kits. Man, you really have to be careful through here. You even just bump into it. You're taking damage. Uh, makes me kind of cautious about going into unnecessary air like right there got hit you know just bumped into it from the side oh what's that thing paternal preternatural flower uh you know what? i don't want to get it's dripping i don't want to get too close oh contamination source and i got the seeds Just look for the glowing sacks. Uh, again, I don't want to get too close. Oh, uh, oh, apparently I'm going to have to get in close. One there we go. Uh-oh. Where's the spot I could get to shoot it? Looks like it's 
inside the tube. That's not fair. Okay. Yeah, like it's in the tube. Uh, so I guess I'm going this way. Yay! That's what I want to do. Crawl inside the tube with a thing at the end. Printer natural seeds. All right, I got 30 seeds. 10 from each of those. And it doesn't seem to get rid of the vines. I kind of was hoping maybe they start to rot away. Make it a little easier to get around. But no, it doesn't. Instead, it seems like it just stops you from being hurt by them. Yeah, this is pretty much just like a maze in terms of finding your way around everything. But we got this top location now. And you know what? I did not get a... There's a thing to scan here when I got here. It didn't tell me that. But medical station. And oh, hey, yeah, reagents. Thank you. After I got the supplies to make more, uh, I, I show up here and I could get the reagents without having to do that. Ooh, a capsaicin. So you don't just get capsaicin from peppers. Like, you don't process. I feel like we should be processing peppers for capsaicin. Like, it's logical. Uh, research. Oh, I don't know why that's stuck. What? There we go. Uh, NH15 X21 O virus, the smog influenza, not respond to any medications. Uh, virus itself remains intact, even though you get rid of the symptoms. Yeah, okay. Uh, source of, we have not found it transmitted by methods, uh, uh no methods of pathogen propagation. Okay, so you, you, everybody gets sick from it sooner or later. You just don't know where it came from, how it gets transmitted around. Just as if we were programmed for extinction, as if nature had planted a charge in us that would explode once we totally effed up the earth. Uh, so, so it's kind of like that uh, M. Night Shyamalan movie, The Happening, where nature just turned against us. 30 out of 100 in the stack for preternatural seas. And I've got... Three reagents. Also got a brain cleanser, which, you know, conveniently I needed earlier and did not have it. Capsaicin, curing feet, increases body temperature, curing your fever. But your fever is already why you're, like, you're hot. Like, right? Like, fever makes you hot, so you just make yourself hotter. So the fever is not so bad. Capsaicin, lobster chili. Fortunately, I've got that. Brain cleanser, green colander. Uh, and those are just, you know, the fevers. Now let's get this one. One printer natural seed, just, just one. That's all you need. And an energy crystal. Okay. Medical station, a bed, energy crystal, five, and one motherboard. That's kind of interesting as requiring a bed, but it makes sense. And it's exactly because it requires a bed that you're going to find this in the upgrade fabricator, upgrade station, as opposed to just the regular fabricator. So here we go. So now it's saying to go to a second infected greenhouse tower to get the data from the computer there and i still have some immunity booster left so i'm gonna try to do this quickly just uh maximize the use of this booster i mean technically i can make another one i just really don't want to have to deal with that and this time i'm going to actually park where i can walk out using the plank because you know why have to do the extra steps when I can just come straight here and, uh, oh, 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 let me, yeah, I had that ready to plant down when I realized I need to hurry. Two contamination sources remain active. Another tube. I have a feeling. Yep, look at that. Oh, that ah, reload. One contamination source remains active. Hydration. Now. I see glow. I see glow. That's all you gotta look for is where it's glowy. And boom, no area. more contamination. Immunity booster, not necessary now. And let's see what we get from this one. We'll go ahead and get that out of the way. Uh, capsaicin, some brain cleanser, medical re... Okay, so I got, yep, the same kind of stuff. Medical hemoglobin purifier. So all the different medical pieces. And then we're going to get two of three... So, let's see if it... Yep, yeah, updates for the next one. Yeah, I need a lot more storage. <laughs> a lot more storage just for this stuff. From the war poster. Let's just see. Add pre natural seeds to use. Okay, that seems a little odd of an ingredient, but uh, I'm, I'll go with it. 
Okay. Yep, come in here. Scans. Oh, it tickles. It tickles. Uh, I guess it's supposed to heal me. Or maybe remove any infections. It's still making noise. The noise did not stop. So I'm thinking now that I've seen how these work, I've done two of them, I'm on my way here to the third one, that knowing the majority of the good stuff is at the very top, you've got three of the little nodules you gotta shoot on each one. Unless you just get really bad luck on where they spawn in relative to each other, you probably could do all three of them with one immunity booster. But I did not do that quick enough, so now here I go with a new immunity booster. And I'm just going to do the same thing again. I'm going to park uh, where I can use my plank. Yep, there we go. All right. So I just going to shoot you because you made me my work. Oh, there it goes. And here we go. The one in the pipe. Oh, uh, reload. I'd like to see maybe, you know, the crossbow work kind of normally, like... I had to reload for those two. Like when you reload, it should add those into its own like separate inventory. So you don't have it showing still separately. Like why am I reloading it if they're not actually getting put into it where it counts as being consumed in the crossbow? Uh, I would like to see that adjusted. That's what most games do, you know, but make it actually go into the crossbow and it's just, you know, you can't take them back out. You just got to use them. All right. Part three, new plants thrive, atmosphere smog, yeah. Okay. Uh, so copy results. All right, so we got that. Let's see what it says. Requires ship workstation, unknown floor. Craft the holographic object at the workstation. I mean, that took practically nothing on my immunity booster to finish that one trip. And look what I got. So many more of these. I, I don't need that many. And the fact that we have all these other things to treat stuff like the hemoglobin purifier and such makes me really wonder what is the use of the medical bay. Because, uh, I mean, everything else we've got covered. If you need healing, you know, med kit. If, if you need something else, you know, covered like one of these, you got these. You know, what is the uh, medical station for? I'm trying to really figure that out because... Right now, I don't know why we would have it. So we've got unknown flora, hologram depicting a plant expected to be the key to the discovery of a cure for the disease. Five crystal, three polymer, one circuit board. Unknown flora. Okay. So place the hologram on the airship. That's literally all it says for me to do. You know what? We're going to be, well, I was going to be decorative with it, but it has to go on the floor or the wall. Ah, uh, ceiling too. All right. Uh, it's like, uh, you know, it's like for the babies, you know, where you have the thing up there they can play with. Yeah, it helps inter help me go to sleep at night. Okay, so we got that. Journey has just begun, so we basically got that. Uh, and so that's, that's it for all that stuff now. All right, cool. So, yeah, you need some stuff from the Underdust. And honestly, because you're going to the Underdust for certain things earlier, I would just, just say go ahead and get everything you can from there. Then, you know, hit every regular greenhouse you can. You know, you're going to find the thorn bees in the Underdust. I found them multiple places in the ones I went to today alone. It's really just finding... The, I still haven't found the the peed, the, the crustipede thing. Uh, I'm not sure why I haven't seen that one yet. But obviously, you don't need it to do this but yeah that's it find yourself a good spot with three of the infected greenhouse towers around you close by knock them out with one immunity booster and get to the end of the current content like i just did